Hey guys, it's Melissa. I'm back. I'm feeling a lot better. I don't sound all the way better, but I'm I'm getting there. And so is my daughter. And I just want to thank you all for your very... You guys are so nice. And I, I can't tell you more um, how much that means to me that you're all, you know, took the time. Because I know it takes time. It's so much easier just to watch a video, you know, and you appreciate it. And then you move on to the next one. But it's really, really appreciated by me anyway um, when you guys take the time out just to write a quick little message or, you know, the little things you write on there. So I just want to take this time. You, you all are too sweet. So it was very nice and um, that you all left to get well wishes. And I appreciate that. So anyway, we're feeling a lot better. Um, we're on our way to recovery, so um, I'm happy about that. But I just wanted to share with you, um, believe it or not, and I still even have more, I still have some um, some things left on my, I got some craft gift cards for Christmas. Um, but I just, when I go, I'll get a little and then, you know, I'll, I'll save it. I won't just spend it just because I have it if there's nothing that I really see that I want, which usually is never the case. But um, just wanted to share with you just a few random things. Um, it's mainly, I went to Michael's, AC Moore, didn't get much of AC Moore. And then um, just two of these little things are from um, Big Lots. But I also, too, before I forget and before I get rambling, um, not that it's that much, but just whenever there's a coupon code, and I appreciate you and you guys um, that send me the personal um, personal messages or let me know when there's freebies and different things like that. So I'm just trying to pass that along. Um, today is anybody who likes the, um, the MMI Creative Time um, brand stamps or anything like that. I believe, I'm pretty sure it's everything, but she... I guess redesigned her shop part of her blog and I don't know if it's just for today um, which is Friday February 17th but there, she, if you use the grand opening code you get 10% off your entire order I believe um, I don't know if it's just the new releases but I'm pretty sure it's an entire order and I think the coupon code is grand opening and in all capital letters um, so just want to share it with you because I appreciate um, Stephanie D2 I know does it a lot um, and One Crafty Cookie she sent me a message when um, Moe's Digital Pencil did that freebie and I appreciate that and I really that's another thing that's really nice that you guys don't have to do and you take the time to do and then we help enable each other but if anybody's interested or is thinking about putting in an order um, I don't work for her or anything I'm not you know under her but I just always appreciate a coupon or a discount not that the 10% is all that much for that um, but you know, it'll help. I'll take a couple bucks off and maybe, you know, get something that you're wanting to get. So anyway, back to my goodies. So I'll just start with some random things. These these little storage, I got my nails painted too, so now you don't have to see my chipped nails from me being sick. <laughs> um, anyway, the, I got a couple more of these. I really like these, they, but these are like so, so cheap. Um, well, they're only 30% off, but they're cheap to begin with because I think they're only $1.49 regularly. But I think this, these came up to $0.79. Cents, so I should have probably got more, but this was a new color, so I got that because I have some others. And it's always good to, you know, if they're nice and small, they don't take up a big footprint, and you can just throw in some pictures that say you have, you know, your next four scrapbook page layouts. And this is quick to bring with you in a crop, put in your bag, and you have your pictures organized. I like it that way. So that was nice and cheap. This same thing, I don't think it was supposed to be that, but she said, I guess these are the same price. This one's a storage case, and she gave this to me for 69 cents or whatever. Whoops. Of course, I can't do it one-handed. How do you do this? Sorry, guys. Let me put these down on this tripod. There we go. See if that helps. All right. This, oh, I zoom upside down. So this is just like a little mini storage case. If I could get it open, here we go. I have to put all the things in it, but it has all these little containers. So I figured this would be nice and small and easy to bring like little mini pearls or um, rhinestones or whatever store in. And that was cheap, you know, for that storage. So I got that. Um, I like, I, and I know a lot of it's holiday, but um, in that dollar bin, things that weren't normally, like these ones weren't, some of them are even more than this, but these ones are regularly $1.99 here, and this one too. But a lot of stuff for the holidays, um, it goes into the dollar bin, and they have Valentine's Day stuff there too. And you know I love my ribbon, so I picked up this one, just the, I had to put my pin in it because it was pulled apart at the store. But it's like a sheer, I don't know if you can see it, but... It's like a sheer um, sparkly glitter ribbon, but I thought that would be cute to tie up a present or a bow, whatever. And it would, the colors are easy to match with any paper. So I picked that up, and that was in the dollar bin. 
the ribbon doll ribbon bin and this was the another holiday I had this in pink and I wanted to do this color in like a craft paper scrapbook layout I thought that would be pretty lavender and craft um, so I got that with the idea in mind so I got that for a dollar then they had this and I think it was a, on sale or clearance out for a dollar forty nine but I think it ended up coming to a dollar on my receipt but there are like 3D um, black and white polka I don't know if the polka dot's showing up to you, but that was a cute little font. Um, little puffy stickers. So got them. I got this little leaf punch that was a dollar. Sorry for this glare. Because um, that would be cute to add just a little leaf one, maybe a small little tag or something for the fall. I love doing fall layouts. So I got that for fall in mind. Um, then I got, let's see, that was AC Martin. Let's finish Michael's. Then I got this, they had 70% off all their Valentine's Day, and let me get my receipt and see how much this was. I think this was 49 cents, and it is just that felt ribbon to celebrate it, and it's just, you, could, you know, just like a banner you could put, you know, on your cards, so cards or layouts. I got that, because that was cheap enough. Then I got these, which I think came to 30 cents, these little heart clips, um, they, you know, they bag of this glare. I thought they were cute so I could use them for something. And um, I also got this because Rashida when we went to the crop, I, I didn't think I needed this. I thought, what would I do with these little hearts? But Rashida and I see Sherry from Scrap and Wrappin', she does a lot of cute little cards. Um, and it's just, I love punches sometimes. There's not, I, I say this all the time, but I love, love, love my Cricut. However, there are times when we feel lazy and you don't want to whip out the cricket for say something this little and punches are so like instant gratification you do it you're done you got your pieces if you need more you just you know punch at it more and you're good but she um sherry over at scrap and wrapping i seen rashida use it and i used it for um what well, rashida was nice enough to let me use hers while we were at the crap at the crop did i say at the crap I meant at the crop. <laughs> um, let me use it while we're at the crop, and I used a couple little hearts because it's good just to, um, you don't even have to use them all. You just use little little ones, and it kind of accents whatever you have, and I thought it had a cute thing, so I got that. And with my 40% off, um, then let me finish Michael's. Then they had these, and I think these came to 20 cents each, and I've seen all you guys have these. This one, I would have been dying. This one, I'll show you. It says, um, stuck on you. I was dying to have a little tag that says, stuck on you for this, but with me getting sick and all, I just kind of finished. This was a leftover from my daughter's Valentine, um, little Valentine treat, but the teacher encouraged them to write their own names, so that, that wasn't me. <laughs> but um, anyway... I, was, I wanted some little tag or something that said stuck on you because, of course, my husband, we show him these and he goes, they're cute, but what does a porcupine have to do with, or whatever this is, I think it's really a hedgehog, what does a porcupine have to do with Valentine's Day? I said, oh, hush up, it has to, it's just cute and that's it. <laughs> so, I'm like, you always got something to say, but I initially wanted something like that and I was going to print it up on the computer, but this probably would have been too small anyway if I could block that out, so it might not even have worked, but for future, that's a cute little one and my michaels i never saw these do around valentine's day i saw you guys getting them at the other michaels um but then all of a sudden they were there so i don't know if they transfer you know the clearance junk from michaels to michaels not junk because obviously i bought it but um so i got the stuck on you one which is really cute um i saw um janice from the cricketologist she had this one and i thought it was cute and i saw a few other of who got it this one's a little squirrel or some little fat squirrel with a heart nut and says i'm nuts about you with hearts around them and i just like this little bubblegum thing but yeah but these were only 30 cents so you know because everything was 70 percent off at the valentine's day and then i got this this is one of the other ones i didn't get i got the love struck one and then i wanted to get the smitten one so these were ridiculously cheap so i got them then, I don't know what she charged me for this one, if it was a dollar or not, probably because it's the new Easter one. Or, oh no, it was 49 cents, because my Michaels, they have 49 cents. Here it is on my receipt. Um, but anyway, I got this one because I just thought it was cute for um, future, because we do a little egg hunt for Maya. Well, we don't. The Easter Bunny does. So that is that was for Maya. What else did I get? Oh, and here's another thing from Michaels. I got these, and they were on sale, I think, for $1.99. And let me come back so I can show you how 
Look how much is on here. You've probably seen these. I have these in other colors, but I didn't have them in white, and I figured white would be good to have it. And there, these will last forever. There's so many different ones and fonts. Then I get up, and then this one was also came up, just 99 cents. And I was happy to pay $1.99, so I was like, yay. So I got that, so that's good to have. Um... I forget it. And then the last thing from Michael's. Yeah. I oh, know. Then I got this. I've been looking at this too. And I just, it's so funny because I just saw, um, I don't know if you guys are subscribed to her, but, um, I think, I believe she's Miss McCabe Scraps. Um, but she was looking for one of these and she said she went to her Michael's and there was one left. And I've been looking, the same thing happened because I wanted to get this for, let me get up and grab it. Um, my daughter colored this, but I had this stamp, and I I wanted to get I wanted to do something fun with this little. This is a was this CC Designs? I forget what this little fairy or something. I remember it was called, but this is my daughter's color, and I thought she did good. <laughs> um, but anyway, I wanted to get something like that, and wanted to get this little mason jar stamp. I figure there's different things too. You could do, I don't know how many, I don't know how many of the little girl images would fit in here, but this this one I remember was tiny, so that'll fit in there just fine. And I wanted to put like the glossy accents on the top of the jar, or maybe a ribbon around the edge of the jar to make it look like a real jar. So that was that, and the last thing at Michael's was, let me come back, I got this, this was in the clearance section, and this was, was it Sherry from Scrap and Wrap when I saw too? And I thought it was cute, and she said that she got hers, um, that's her friend, I think it was Nicole from Scrapology, I could be messing this up, but I'm just trying to go off my memory, but anyway, her friend got her one, they, she got two, and she gave her one, but I just think this would be a cute future project, too, to paint up, and, you know, you could put pictures in it, this one, sh it shows it as a, it says seashore, I sound like an idiot, seashore, seashore display box, yeah, and it, um, shows, like, stuff, but I'm not gonna do it like that, and I may even use, I wanna use my crackle finish, I have that, um, that crackle finish paint that you would paint, paint on, you can use whatever color paint you want and it'll do the crackle. So I want to, I want to do a project with that. So that's a future thing. But anyway, this was clearance. So I didn't, it didn't have a price back there. I get up the front and it was, came up 50, 59 cents. So figure for that. You can't beat that for a little project for 59 cents. And then last couple things real quick. This is going to take forever to upload because I'm rambling. Um, this was AC Moore. This is the only thing I got that, oh no, I got punches. Um, the, from Hampton Art, and it's that Kelly Panacci. Um, and I think I seen, uh, Vicky from Me Love Bono. I don't know if it was, whoa, I don't know if it was this one or not, but I thought this was a good, fun little font that I could even, um, color in the inside with my Copics and all to use for my layouts or cards or whatever. So I got that, the Hampton Art foot long, and these, all the, um, all their clear and all their wooden stamps are every no matter which brand they are are 40 percent off this week so if you guys wanted to check that out so everything was 40 percent off and then i just got these two on clearance and they were really cheap um i think it was like four dollars five dollars um this i've been looking at because i wanted to get i don't know if you can see with the glare see the hearts um so it punches that out i was looking well paper tray ink has a heart die that i don't know when they're going to decide to have it in stock but you know me with the hearts hence my name i love the hearts but anyway um i was looking at the paper tray ink one and every time i go it says it's not yet available check back for availability blah blah and I was going to get the die for it, which this is even actually better, but I just didn't know that they had, you know, one like that. And because then I don't have to whip out the cuddle bug. So, um, cause I seen, um, Sherry too, she has something similar, but I think hers is a die and she put that on her cards and I was looking for something like this for a while. So I picked up that one and it was on sale a little cheap, I guess for Valentine's Day. Then I got this one, which is, oh God, don't even look at my morning hair. Um, which is like a heart scroll. So. I got that there, and is that it? Uh, the last quick two things. I got this little rose thing for, I don't know if I like this or not, but I, I need, um, there was a couple sympathy cards I wanted to make, and I needed like a, obviously not all, you know, cheery, not that this is sad, but I, you need something a little more mature, we'll say. So I don't know if I'm liking this for that or not, but I just thought maybe this would be fun to color with the Copics. But I don't really like, I guess I'm spoiled with the prices from Michael's, but the this was $2. 
which to me is kind of high for this is a smaller stamp. And they have even smaller ones that they're charging $2 for a stamp. So it's unusual I got that, but I kind of got that so I have that for purposes like that. But I guess, like I said, I'm spoiled with my Michaels, you know, my 49 cent stamps, which I think are cuter than that. But anyway, let me get off. I'm, I'm hating on big lots. I just haven't been finding good stuff there lately, but I had to run in there for something. <clears throat> And there's one right by my house, and I got two of these. So I thought this would be cute. Not for this mom's diner thing, but I just like this little, um, they were a dollar, these two, she I got picked up too. But um, just like when me and my husband, we go to this one, um, or if we go to like Italian restaurant or something, I just like the, the look of that bread and these peppers and, you know, tomatoes and little things. So if we went out to dinner, I wanted to use these sticker, look at the little salt and pepper shaker. So I got these two for a dollar. And that about, <clears throat> excuse me, that about wraps it up. So I got through most of this video. And even with all my talking and um, without coughing so bad. So that's always a plus because you guys heard me in my last video. So again, thank you all for your get well wishes. I hope you're all doing well. And um, uh, thank you for watching. And yeah, don't forget that if there was something you wanted at um, my creative time, I think the coupon code is 10% off everything. It might just be for today, but 10% everything on ev your order using the grand opening coupon code. So... All right. Thank you guys. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.